Example number 3. Solve the differential equation x dy over dx plus x minus y equal x power of 3. Given y in bracket 1 equal to 1. The solution are... Firstly, simplify the equation, which is divide by x. And we get dy over dx minus y over x equal x power of 2 minus 1, which is the new equation. Next, I, we must identify function px from the equation. And we know that function px equal negative 1 over x. Next, find if from the formula. We get 1 over x. M, multiple de with if and express the equation above. From here, P, which is product rule. Next, I integrate both sides. We get y over x equal x power of 2 over 2 minus ln x plus c. We must substitute x equal to 1 and y equal to 1 from the equation above to find c. And we get c equal 1 over 2. Lastly, y. So, we know that from the equation, we get y over x equal x power of 2 over 2 minus ln x plus half. And lastly, y equal x power of 3 over 2 minus x ln x plus x over 2. Example number 4. Solve the differential equation dy over dx plus y over tangent x equals sine x over tangent x. Given that y equal to 0 and x equal to 0. The solution are as we must simplify the equation. We must remember that tangent x equal to sine x over cos x. And we get dy over dx plus cos x over sine x y equal to cos x. I identify function px, which is we must compare with the equation above. So we know that function px equal cos x over sine x. Find integrating factor. We get sine x m multiple de with if and express the equation above. From the equation, we must use a product rule to get the new equation. Next, I integrate both sides. The formula given sine 2x equal to sine x cos x. So, we get negative 1 over 4 cos 2x plus c. Remember, must substitute x equal to 0 and y equal to 0. And we get c equal 1 over 4. 
next y. y sine x equal negative 1 over 4 cos 2x plus 1 over 4. Let's do math exercise. The solution cover a differential equation of form dy over dx equal to y plus 3x passes through the points in bracket 0, 3 over 4 and in bracket ln 1 over 2 beta. Determine the value of beta in the logarithm form. So, remember students, please complete this exercise after watching the video. You can submit the soft copy or capture image of the solution by using Google Classroom or hard copy on your lecture's desk. So, that's all from me. Thank you.